How's it going, guys? I'm here to review Silver Bullet 1985, based on the Stephen King novel directed by Dan Adius and stars Gary Busey, Corey Haim, and more. The plot for this film starts when a series of unexplained murder that occur in the normal, quiet town of Tarker's Mill. The residents decide to hunt down the killer, but however, many of them end up dead. But when a young wheelchair using boy named Marty encounters a werewolf one night, uh, that's when it's up to him to begin a mission to destroy the werewolf with the help of his sister and his uncle. The writing in this film is good, and it's straight to the point. The direction in this film is good, and I enjoy this film for what it is. It reminds me of those fun kids 90s movies like The Sandlot, but a werewolf thrown in. Like It has that same feel. Or like like eighties movies like The Goonies or Stranger Things and stuff like that, just about like kids going on an adventure and hunting down a person or a creature or whatever. So it has that feel. And the cinematography is well done. The acting might be a little cheesy, but it works for this film. It gives it a charm. Corey Haim, R. I. P. Uh Corey Haim and Gary Busey did excellent in this film. The editing is good and simple. The sound and the score in this film is okay, but it has the typical like 80s and 90s Steven Spielberg-ish music for me, like a John Williams feel, which is okay, but I feel like it doesn't fit for this film, honestly. Um, the production design in this film is good. The casting in this film is great. The special effects for the kills and gore is dope, but the actual werewolf itself looked kind of corny to me, but overall, not bad. So if I have to give this movie a 10 i would give this film a 7 out of 10 so that was my quick review of stephen king's silver bullet 1985 please leave a like subscribe leave a comment and i'll see you guys in the next one